So welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to talk about how to fix SIM card detected error on your Android device and how to fix this app. So let's get started. So what you have to do is when you're having this trouble you just have to follow these instructions and the first one when you're having this trouble is you have to do a normal restart. So to do restart you just have to press volume down button and power button and you just have to keep press and hold this for a shorter period of time so hardly around 10 seconds so that your system will i mean your device will be like a restart and you have to see whether you are still having the sim card issue or not and if it's not working then we have solution 2 so solution 2 is all about what you have to do is just have to go for you just have to check with reinserting the sim and see whether the issue is solved or not most probably sometimes by reinserting the sim on your on your sim card the issue can be fixed so this is one of the solution and the third one which i would like to make a notice is you just have to enable airplane mode as you can see that if you go to the notification bar over here you'll be having airplane mode over here right so you just have to enable this okay you just have to enable this and you just have to wait for a couple of minutes and you just have to disable this and you have to see whether the issue is solved or not most probably by doing this so sometimes the issue has to be fixed and moving on to the next one is all about what you have to do is the next one is all about you have to re-enable the sim card so re-enable the sim card in the sense you have to reinsert your sim card once you reinsert the sim card once it is done you just have to tap here on the settings now from here you have an option called mobile network so you just have to select this from here you just have to an option called sim management you have to select this and as you can see that this will be disabled okay if it is disabled you have to check whether it is disabled or not so if it is disabled you just have to enable it which means the sim has been re-enabled and the options has been set according to it so you just have to what happens is you have to make sure that this is not disabled so you just have to enable this that is what you have to do moving on to the next solution if it's not working then we have we have to depends on many other things so why we are having these kind of issues so next one is all about you just have to uh, make sure self is all about you just have to make sure you are having the latest updates so it is very important for your system so what you have to do is just have to check tap over here on the settings now from here you just have to scroll down you have to click over here system and updates and you have to tap here on the software update and you have to see whether you are on the latest version as you can see i'm using huawei so this is my os and i have to make sure so that i'm on the latest uh, latest version or not so as you can see here it is mentioned that i am in the latest version so there is no issue with mine so if it is not the latest version then you just have to update into the latest version and see do a restart to after the update and see whether the issue is solved or not and if it's not working then you just have to go for the next one even before getting to the last thing i would like to make you notice two more steps which is very quite simple so what is it's all about is it's all about a reset network settings so what you have to do is just have to do this up so in order to do this you just have to go over here in the settings now from here just have to scroll down and you have to click over here on system and updates and there is an option called reset you just have to tap over here and there is an option called reset all settings reset network settings and also reset phone so you just have to tap here on the reset network settings and you have to go for it and most probably when you tap on reset network settings these are the things that this will reset network settings including wi-fi mobile data and bluetooth so you just have to go for it and once it is done you just have to go back and see whether the issue is solved or not and if it's not working then we have one more suggestion which i would like to give you guys so the next solution is all about uh, the factory reset okay the factory reset so what you have to do is you just have to follow the same instruction just have to tap here go for system and updates and go for reset and you have an option called reset all setting and reset phone so this is these are the things which you'll be doing in between so you just have to go for erase all data and then once it is done you can select all these things and it will be like a reset so you just this will be taking out to this and after doing this up out you have to check whether the issue is solved or not on your sim and if it's not working the last one which i would like to give you notice is it is quite simple that what you have to do is have to contact the customer support so customer support in the sense you just have to talk to them so uh, most probably while inserting the sim if it's not getting connected or if you're not getting any kind of uh, points over here on the network then you will not be able to talk to them so what you have to do is in that case you have to go and meet an expert 
talk to them and what is the issue. Most probably these are the basic steps what you have to do when you're having these kind of issues and this will be helping you go helping you guys out and if you have any doubts do ask in the comment section so I will get back to you. This is Shahin officially signing off from Getcha Tips. Keep practice social distance, be safe and stay safe.